There's a book called Atomic Habits by uh, James Clear, where what he does is actually talks about uh, the small things you can do in your life to be able to change and make a large, like a big progress or a big change. And uh, one of the things that I wanted to bring up is that in this, you can see that everybody really everybody thinks that they're going to be in that linear progress when they start something that they're just going to start uh and then it's just going to be a straight hill from there but it's not usually it's more like what they call the valley of disappointment the reason why that's important is because as you uh go on and do the things that you want to do typically the first probably quarter of everything that you're trying to accomplish seems like almost nothing it seems like you're not really doing anything there's no progress there's no nothing and in that red line that's usually where almost everybody gives up whether it's exercising more whether it's something they want to do in their business whether it's whatever it doesn't matter it usually comes down to that now what you can see is that linear progress where you think you're going to be let's say in you know whatever time amount of time that you want it to be it's not even close to what ends up happening what ends up happening is that after you get out of that valley of disappointment then your business really takes off that's the reality of how it actually works so if you're trying to do something and your business is struggling to get up off the ground and you're facing a lot of hardships and everything like that just remember that's how it is for everybody Nobody is nobody ever has linear success or linear progress. Everybody makes a bunch of little changes as they make mistakes, as they go through their failures, and then it leads up to one big uh victory in the end. So don't get stuck in the valley of disappointment and think that that's all there is in life. If you're looking to fund your business, you better call Sal.